and welcome to day 11 of the 12 days of N scale. This is a 12 part series where I share the joy of running my N scale trains on a very temporary holiday layout. If you're a model railroader who wants to run a lot of steam locomotives, then I hate to break it to you. N scale is probably not the scale you want. And that's okay. I chose N scale for many other reasons, as you know, most dating back to my childhood. And I do have that Pennsylvania Railroad steam locomotive I showed you on day one. But if there was one, just one, steam locomotive that I could get for my layout, guess what it would be? That's right, this steam locomotive needs no introduction. This is Reading Blue Mountain and Northern's number 425, the locomotive that I affectionately call the Blue Beauty. And now it's all mine in N scale, of course. So the real 425 is a Baldwin Light Pacific built in January of 1928 in Philadelphia. So this very detailed N-scale replica is made by Broadway Limited. It's the only locomotive I've bought of theirs, and I've got to say, I am beyond impressed. And because I know the real locomotive so well, I can really appreciate all the fine detail that went into this model. The only real complaint I have, and it is minor, is that the blue is a little bit too dark of a shade, whereas the real 425, particularly when you see it in the sunlight, is a slightly brighter and more vibrant shade of blue, a little bit more similar to the diesel 426 that I showed you yesterday. But that's minor. Because the one thing that blew me away when I first put 425 on the rails and gave it some power was the sound. For now, I just run a standard DC system, and this locomotive was only available as DCC, although I had it on good authority that it would run on a DC system. But I didn't know the sound would work on DC as well, and knowing the real locomotive as well as I do, I can tell you that these sounds are pretty accurate. Now what I don't have yet is full control over the range of the sounds. It has its sound at idle, it has its sound when it's gaining steam and picking up speed, and then it has its sound when it's running full throttle. But I can't yet activate the bell, the whistle, and a whole host of other sounds that you do need a sound controller or DCC system to activate. That will be remedied very soon though. I actually have purchased a hybrid controller, I just can't run it on this temporary layout yet, but that's something we can look forward to in the new year.
So as I wrap up day 11 on the 12 days of end scale, you've got to be thinking, Jamie, this is your dream locomotive. I thought this would be day 12. What could you possibly be doing on day 12 that is better than this steam locomotive? Well, you're just going to have to tune in to day 12 to find out. Merry Christmas and thanks for watching.